Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Stitching with Laura. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a great day. Well, today we have another unbagging. That means we have another review. Let's take a look and see who this is from. Oh my. I see trouble on the way. Whoa. Sorry, everything's going left and right. All right, this comes from Biggest Craft, and we'll start with the one that wanted to be first, I guess. So it's another one of the little new magnets that they have come out with. That is, if I can get it out of the box. Oh my goodness, it's like stuck it in there. Come on, okay, we'll just do it the easy way. There we go. This one's square, it's not ob a rectangle. And they have these in all of the seasons. Let me see if I can just cut this out of there. So, of course right now, let me get rid of this stuff. It is winter. And of course it has a piece of plastic over it which it takes a hot moment but maybe not right now it has a piece of plastic protecting it but it kind of has a winter I mean Christmas theme to it it has like bows and what do you call it? white poinsettias and pine cones and pine boughs so yeah, I thought I'd start collecting these for whatever season it was. Yeah, that cute. And those are a dollar ninety-nine. So they have the older ones, like I've already gotten, but they have the four seasons, and then they came out. Let's see if I can do this without shaking too much. With the new. Uh, Peony and uh, the one with the yellow birds. Yeah. So I thought that would be just too cool. Had to have it. All right. You'll remember some time back I got. Oh, it's actually just sitting right here. Because, yeah, the baiting. So it was one of the little girls. There's like three or four of them. So I got the next one. I got that one from Fan Cells. So this one I got from Biggest Craft. Isn't she cute? Little lotus flowers and lanterns. Yeah, I just thought these were whimsical, if you will. But they went along with my ancient beauties, if you will. I don't know. It does and it doesn't. Whoops. I put the bag in the wrong place. Okay, let me pull. Oh my goodness, get out seriously. Very nice picture, and it's on glossy paper this time instead of like a dulled paper. Isn't that cute? And it is. It's called Lotus Girl, and it was $7.99. And I didn't. It's a 40 by 50. I was going to say I didn't write it down. Let's get out the paper. Maybe. So it has a nice big pattern. Has 30 colors. Very nicely printed. It has product number, how big it is, how many squares per square. Does have the colors running down the side. This pattern will match your canvas. So yeah, very easy to read. I mean, you might want to look through a magnifier. I mean, it depends. Everybody's eyes are different. But I can totally see this it is full coverage let's take a look at the colors oops that before I forget there are two needles there let's take a look at all the pretty colors there's just one floss card here let's see if I can grab a hold of everybody but yeah some nice antique looking colors and you do have some bright ones some bright green this is a little bit brighter, and then you have a darker red, kind of a brick red over here. Very nice. 
Very nice indeed. That looks like 3771. Not sure. It is. It's a dark brown. And I'm assuming it's for that. I can't see it from that picture, huh? Parts of her hair and then this little, I don't know, partition or doorway thing there. But I just thought she was sweet looking. Yeah, beautiful colors. Lots of them. You don't have much of that color. Maybe it's just going in a certain spot. But it's not too big. It's a 40 by 50, so that's a nice size. Very nicely printed. I don't see any smears. It has the product number, how big it is, and how many squares per square. This one actually has a nice big key. has all the colors running down the side. DMC number, symbols, numbers on the thread card. But very easy to see symbols and everything. So, yeah, I just thought this was cute. Let's see how big it is here. It, it is not surged. Hang on, I keep hitting my bell here. It's not surged all the way around. It is 49 or 19 and a quarter-ish inches by 40 centimeters or like 15 and three quarters the actual picture is 11 and three quarter inches or almost 30 centimeters and going up and down 15 and a half or 39 and a half centimeters so it's not too big but yeah I just think it's cute I just like all the elements in it yeah, and it has some nice big areas. It does have some confetti down, you know, kind of sprinkled here and there because of your lotuses. There's several different colors. They're the same symbols, you know, in the lotuses to bring those out. And then, of course, you got some flowers here. So, very nice. Very, very nice indeed. I love it. Okay. Now, the next one. I, 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 I don't know. I think now I was supposed to get this in an 11 count. Guess what? It didn't happen. Well, that's bizarre as hell. Okay, I'll show you what I mean. Hang on. Here we go. Let the games begin. I was panicking for nothing. But right on here, it does say 11 count, and that's the product number. Yeah, it is an 11 count canvas. But look at this. Look how tiny it is. I freaked. I thought it was going to be in 18 count. I was like, oh, no, 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 no. I'll never finish this. No, 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 no. Yeah, 11 count, 50 by 65. 191 by 256 and it is a nativity picture i saw this on diamond painting effects with corey go check her out she has cross stitching and diamond painting and i thought this was the nicest looking rendition of a nativity that i had seen all season and i like the one that i have that is um like a stained glass it yeah I like it, but I like this better. It's just absolutely a beautiful picture. Yeah. And I like the three wise men and the the star up here. It's just absolutely beautiful, but I can't get over how small this part is. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Big, big pattern here. Does have a little itty-bitty thing on how to start, how to end. That kind of thing. Man, I've got to move that bell. It has 41 colors. It does have the colors of the threads running down the sides. DMC symbols. And the thread card numbers. Just like the last one, this will match the canvas. But yeah, it's just very well done. And I hope that all 
of the the details will come out in it and 50 by 65 it's a decent size and this looks like it the picture I don't know if you can see Joseph and Mary here and then there's like a burrow here um, but they're closer in so you know there, there should be better details on their their clothes and then the baby Jesus is right about in here so yeah very nice very nice indeed but it's got 41 colors and I'm glad I got this I don't know you know how soon I'll start this but we'll see let's take a look at the colors if I could get them out of this bag and put that up there you have a hank of 317 whoops avalanche yeah go that way if you're gonna go anyway go that way and this is 413 you can barely tell the difference I don't know if you're picking that up or not this one's a little more charcoal color. This is more of a like a charcoal green, if you will. And what do we got here? We got 3799. So there's 40 strands of all three of those colors. And that's kind of a, a dark green, if you will. So that's nice. Like that. Then we have... A toolkit with five needles, poof ball, thimble, and needle threader with the plum blossom, cherry blossom, peach blossom. I don't know. It's a blossom. How's that? We'll just set it over there for right now. And take a look at all these beautiful colors. The blues and the golds and the tans. Isn't that beautiful? Soft, soft thread. Very nice. They do a good job with the threads. I have yet to get a bad kit that had horrible thread or anything. But yeah. Dark blues, browns, dark browns. There's more dark brown over here. Very lovely. And a piece of fuzz. Yay, bonus. Very nice. Very nicely done. Just gorgeous. Rich deep rich colors I think it will be beautiful so we'll see you know when I started I'm not not real sure let's take a look at the canvas let's cut the edges please I love how they leave all those little strings right there they catch on everything later Let's take a look at this canvas. Now it's up and down. Let's see if I can get it flipped up here. Product number, how big it is, and how many squares per square. Very nicely printed. Very big. You can see all of the... We'll just do it this way. All of the symbols really well. And then I'll flip it. Very nice. I don't see any smears. Anybody see any smears? Jeez. I can't believe I did that whole video on that one that did have the smears, and I didn't even notice it. But, yeah. Very nicely done. Very nice. And this is fair good size. But it is a gorgeous, gorgeous picture. It is surged all the way around. I don't know that I told you that or not. And the stitching kind of goes into the numbers, but your paper pattern match, it doesn't have the, the colors going down the side. But the rest of it is very easy to read. You can tell what symbol goes to what. But yeah, let me see if I can measure. Let's measure across first. Don't, whoop. Might help if I get the right side going. It is 20 inches across, or 51 centimeters. Let me see. I'm going to try to lay it out and see if I can measure it that way. 
Oh yeah, we got this. It is 66 and a half centimeters or 26 and a quarter inches. The actual picture size is 44 and a half centimeters or 17 half inches across by 59 centimeters or 23 and a quarter. Hmm. Okay. So it, it's kind of wide and kind of big. Does have big areas, like I said. It's going to have confetti. There's no getting around it, but when you have confetti, you got details. So I'm not complaining. I just sometimes don't care to work on them. But very nicely printed. Let me see if I can pull it up so you can see all the and hold it as still as I possibly can. All the nice symbols. Very, very easy to see. Very nice. Now this one was $14.99. And I'm thinking it's still available. They haven't taken down the Christmas stuff. They have stuff in, you know, different festivals. And, you know, like Christmas and Halloween and whatever else. I don't know if they have an Easter section. They do have a religious section. So, you might want to check that out if you're looking for a copy of that. But, yeah, I thought that was the best rendition of the nativity thing I had seen. Thank you, Corey. Loved it. And she even did a stitch with me on that. So, just very beautiful. Very beautiful. Now, Biggest Craft does have uh, cross stitch. And they only have stitching things. Like, they do have some latch hook. But they have cross stitch. Uh, beaded cross stitch, embroidery, uh, punch needle supplies. They have lots of tools and crafts for all of that. And there, if there's any specials that they're running right now, I put that in the description below. And I believe over a certain amount, you get uh, free shipping over $49. If that has changed, I will change it as well. So do check them out. Thank you, Biggest Craft, for sending me these beautiful things. They were just gorgeous. Just what I expected. About had a heart attack because I thought it was coming in an 18 count when I saw that picture. Yeah. Uh, no. We'll never get through it. No. Not happening. But, yeah. I, I work on my 18 counts. Yeah. I gotta be in the mood. Yeah. Alright. Thank you, Biggest Craft. Thank you all for watching today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and please hit the bell. That way you'll know when my next video comes out. Stay safe, stay healthy. We'll see you next time. God bless. Bye-bye.